Hey guys, I got another unboxing for you. Uh, today I'm going to be unboxing uh, Sony Vegas Movie Studio HD Platinum. Uh, again, uh, I'll do a lot of my electronic shipping and you know uh, software and stuff like that at Fry's Electronics. Uh, they mistagged this. Let me see if you can catch this a little bit with the macro. Uh, $69.99, if you can see it there. Um, I told them about it and they're like, no, this is for uh, an audio um, application, uh, yada, yada, yada. So I said, you know what, you know, I don't want it. This is uh, cheaper than what you're charging me. They're like, no, we have uh, rebates. Um, the tag, as you can see, is $69.99. They charged me $79.99 for it. But with the rebates, it's free, actually. There's two rebates that you've got to mail in. Both are for $40, so basically... Uh, you're getting this for free So let me go ahead and open this up There we go ah. Okay, so there's nothing there Everything's here. Oh Look at that for 80 bucks They give you paper 3d glasses and that song so you get Movie Studio HD Platinum, uh, Sony Creative Software Product Overview, and this is uh, installation instructions basically. Wow. I mean, yeah, I've heard a great deal about Sony Vegas, uh, you know, Sony being such a big company and all. And a lot of people on YouTube make their videos with Sony Vegas. They, you know, there's really a myriad of a plethora of applications that people can use for their video editing uh, needs. But uh, as far as Sony Vegas is concerned, uh, for $80, uh, including free 3D glasses like this, I think is a joke. Um, really more like an insult I would say <laughs> you know eighty dollars yeah the application is good and yeah we're gonna throw in some 3d glasses that's really the uh, I think is a deal breaker for me um, unfortunately with software you can't return this once it's open and I had the intention of buying it because um, I want to try it out uh, the application I'm using is uh, Camtasia it's really designed for uh, screen capture not really uh, video editing but that's what I've been working with um, trying to avoid using Windows Movie Maker. It's really, you know, if Contagia is limited. Um, what can I say about Windows Media, uh, Windows Movie Maker? But anyway, uh, the fact that it is $80, it's a good application to what most people say, most of the reviews. I have yet this, I have yet to try this myself, but um, uh, I think they can do a little better when it comes to uh, their 3D glasses. There was actually another application of an unknown uh, manufacturer. Um, I can't recall the name right now, but uh, it came with the uh, application CD and it came with, uh, I think it was like two or three other CDs that gave you like a 90 day trial on those other CDs, whether you wanted to keep them or not. They all had different features. Uh, the main application was a, a video editing tool and, you know, it includes, um, you know, picture in picture editing, uh, audio dubbing. Uh, special effects, tie subtitles, stuff like that. Pretty much just like a uh, uh, Sony Vegas, but uh, since it's an unknown brand, I kind of thought, well, let me try Sony Vegas. Since I, I really wanted to try this before anything else. But what was impressive about that one is was um, it was about thirty dollars less, and it actually included some decent looking plastic. Um, 3D glasses. I mean, had they been dark, you can actually wear those out as sunglasses. They they, they look pretty good, even though they were they were plastic. They were it was a cheap plastic. They were out in the outside of the box. I mean, you could see them. It said included free 3D glasses, and it had the plastic kind of cut out like that, so you can see them from both angles like that, both sides. Um, it looked pretty good, but the brand name just didn't convince me. I've never heard of them, so I was like, you know, let me try this first. But uh, when I read it said it has 3D glasses included, I assumed it was something nicer. 
being that it's Sony Vegas, but uh, bummer, <laughs> bummer. So hopefully this particular video I'm going to be editing with Sony Vegas, and then uh, we'll see how it works out.